Hello friends, welcome back to Illusion of Gaia. We are going to load our diary entry. Ooh, I like the way it moves, that's cool. Underground tunnel with 10 HP, 2 strength, and 1 defense. We are just rocking beast mode here. Oh right, we got, uh, we got this creeper. He's a creepy looking dude. I'm just trying to remember if there's like any kind of, oh, okay. I don't know, is that a block? I'm not sure what that is. Okay, bye Gaia. <clears throat> yeah, at the end of the last episode we transformed into this guy, but I don't really remember anything else. Uh, ooh, okay. I got more range so I can hit the... Oh, he's got more power too. Okay, can I just play as this guy for the rest of the game? I guess we're going this way. Easy game. Oh, hey, head. That's no way to get ahead in life. Ah! Right. I forgot you could kind of like knock guys into each other. I think that's a really cool thing. All right, we got a guy over there. And as I recall, this game like I don't remember if it encourages or requires you to defeat every enemy as you go along. Can't get that. Uh, but I think it's... I think it's mandatory that you beat every enemy as you go. Oh, I did not mean to run. Uh, let's go left. Hey! I like that. A red jewel! Alright. Um, I don't remember quite what the deal with the red jewels is, honestly. I think it's like a scavenger hunty kind of thing in this game. Your defense has increased. Nice. I have two now. Both defenses. <laughs> Friends, I hope you're doing well. I hope you enjoyed episode one. When the enemies are destroyed, Will can return to his original shape. Oh, so this is Will, but like some sort of spiritual manifestation of will and i guess i guess based on that message that i saw when i first loaded our save here uh i'm attacking with a flute oh girl i saw you but i'm surprised you could change your shape like me i'm lily an itery girl protected by the flower spirit how how do you know a melody you could only have heard from us i learned it from grandma lola she hummed it whenever she was upset I have had some of her pie. It tastes rather unusual, doesn't it? You know my grandmother? Actually, she asked me to rescue you. Is that grandma coming? Is she like on a broomstick or something? The elder is calling. I have to go. We'll meet again. Goodbye, Will. Oh. <sighs> yeah. Just blow her away. Edward's Castle. Okay, I can no longer attack, so I think I am just full-on out of combat. But I don't know that I'm supposed to be here, so... Is this a section where I have to be sneaky? Well, there's no enemies to see me, so I guess not. Ah, it's you. You've escaped from the prison. Trust what I say. Run from this castle. It'd be terrible if King Edward found you here. Well, I want to go see the girl. Uh, I don't remember her name, but I want to go see the girl. If you want to take her, now's the time. Oh. Yeah, no, I'm trying, dude. But this guy says I can't. Alright, how do I get girl? Find girl. This way? This way. Are you girl? Don't let the king find you. Please take care of the princess. Oh, oh, the maid is just totally okay with that. But I can't actually do anything here. Nope. I think I have to go up the other stairs? The stairs are very confusing to me. I don't know why. I, I love you. Is that girl saying that? Well, he's shy. I'm glad that somewhere in the world there is someone who's thinking of me. Okay. So that's the, the knight saying it. Hey, girl. Of course you've come. Thank you. 
Was the guard asleep outside? His nickname is Old Snorehead, sleeping again. Your little pig has come. His name is Hamlet. Cute, isn't he? He's very smart. He has some kind of strange pig power. <laughs> Please take me out of here. Bye, Sir Snorehead. Please keep this guy distracted. I don't want to kill him. Yeah. You have nothing new to say. Let's continue. Karen? I thought her name was Kara. Is it Kara or Karen? We should take food. Would you go to the cellar with me? Uh-oh. She's gonna murder me or make out with me, and I don't know. I don't know what to expect here. You found a large yummy roast leg of ya yak. Oh. Alright. Now her name is Kara. Okay. Let's go before... Alright. She doesn't even know who she is. I don't trust her anymore. I, w I was here to, to, to save girl, but girl... Girl's giving me some vibes here. Let's go to your house. I'm worried about your grandparents. Oh, I didn't catch that last thing. Okay, goodbye. Nope. Mode 7 graphics kicking in. Oh. Oh. At the time, those were so cool. And through the eyes of 2024, they are so painful. Um, my house is a mess. It's awful. Who would do such a thing? My grandparents? <laughs> My grandparents would do such a thing. Grandpa Bill, Grandma Lola, I'll look upstairs. Uh, there's probably gonna be a corpse or something. Nope. Alright, bye Karen. Wait, what? Look at the wall? This mark, a jackal. The jackal's here. He's the hunter hired by my mother, an evil man who will stop at nothing. Once he starts after you, there's no stopping him. He has no regard for human life. Oh, I'm getting hunted by the Terminator. Alright. Oh. I guess I blew her all the way home. Don't worry, you two. You're the one who... Who are you? My world's friend. Lily, do you know anything about this? It's okay, your grandpa and grandma are safe. They're in my village. Your village? It's Hori Village. I've never heard of this village. Naturally, my village has a barrier around it. Ordinary people like you can't see it. Let's go, Will. Okay. I'm going too. It's far too dangerous for a princess. You can't stop royalty. I do whatever I want. Well, she is Karen, I guess. Oof. Typical of a princess. <laughs> I think something good is going to happen. Should we meet the townspeople? Wait, what? Let's go see how things are in the village, I guess. A lot of strange merchants lately. Selling weapons used to fight demons. I won't sell a weapon to a child. I don't know. Well, I was like, all excited there. How long have we been playing this? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There goes a bird. Eric's house. Don't worry, I'm not on fire. It's just a treatment. Okay, you already told me that. Heard any good stories? Nope. Alright. See ya. Yeah, uh, it doesn't look like there's a lot different with the townspeople. A strange is a pro something strange. A star is approaching the earth. Okay. Lance's mother... Yep, I don't want to hear about my lost father. Angry parents again. Let's just ignore them. There's a fisherman. I'm going to go down to that cave in a second, but I got a red jewel, and I think... Yeah, no, you already told me that. I think this is the jewel guy? Am I right? Holding one of the red jewels. I uh, give you red jewels. There are three. 
You've collected more than three. You just said three. Oh, I got an herb. Alright. Uh, what, whatever, dude. I don't know what I'm doing with an herb. I'm assuming it's a healing item. But I don't really need it right now. Is there any reason for me to go to school? Plotting something. Wow. Thanks, Father Debbie Downer. Not equipped. I don't want to see Gaia. She's creepy. Alright, let's jump down. Alright. Let's talk to Fish Guy. What's in the cave? Kids! I'm going to win again for sure. You look so gloomy. Yeah. Alright. Even my friends are boring. Can we just leave now? Or did I miss something important here? Be careful. Okay. Are, are the girls with me? <laughs> we go to quit. My favorite town. Alright, should we talk to them now? Hey girl. Yes, ready to go. No, from here on there will be many hardships. You're nitpicking. That's what I expected. Have you ever been outside the castle? Crazy girl. Are you totally ignorant of the world? Will is my friend, understand? Hey Will, aren't you my friend too? Yes, of course. I'm going to the village. Let's go hand in hand. Oh my goodness. Nothing quite like a jealous Karen. Wow, this is a long trip for three kids. Oh, sorry, my microphone's being a little weird. Alright. Tori Village. This is my village, but you're probably surprised that there are no houses. Try playing the melody that called to me under Edward Castle. Where are you going? Play the melody here. I don't remember how. Okay. Oh, restore strength. Okay. Play. Softly play the melody he had learned from Lola. The melody carried on the wind spread over the meadow. Oh, neat. Magic house. Were you surprised? There's a barrier around this village most people can't see. You already told me that. Princess is getting to be a bother. On the road, all I heard was, My feet hurt. I'm thirsty. I'm tired of hearing it. I can't help it. My feet hurt. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, come with me. I'll show you my house. Yeah. I want to go in this one. Can I go up here? Oh, just a one-way slide. There are no other children Lily's age in the village. Please become friends. Bill, you're safe. Oh, terrible thing. I really don't like that the d-pad can skip through the text. I really don't like that. Uh, some soldiers. He almost got us. Grandpa panicked. I destroyed their digestion with a poisoned marsupial pie. What? Then I ran away? We didn't ask her to come along. Will, this is my house. You can look around the village, but then come back here. Nope, nope. I was trying to move, but then... Karen said something. She's being a Karen again. Can't go that way. Who are you? Okay. Okay. 
Try running down that hill and keep running. You'll be surprised. Well, let's go visit Gaia first. Creepy Gaia is going to tell me, kill. Looks like you're hurt. Close your eyes. I'm Gaia, the source of all life. The Psycho Dash can destroy obstacles. Try to destroy suspicious places. Okay. Yeah, let's continue the journey. Can I actually transform now? Psycho Dash can now be used! Only Young Will can use the Psycho Dash. You can smash walls and obstacles by hurling yourself against them. Good uh, sound life advice there, kids. Use the attack button to save energy. Alright. Yeah. I guess we'll just record again. Bye, Gaia. I miss you, you giant creepy floating head. It's the Gaia version of the face of Bo. Oh my goodness. I did not expect that. I was surprised. The game told me I was going to be surprised, and I was surprised. Quiet voice. You've come, Will. Uh. Oh, wait, what? I'm going to... Uh, I can't live without the protection of the flower spirit. You really look like your father. It seems like only yesterday that he came to this village. My father. Your mother, Shira, was the only daughter of your grandparents. She was very beautiful. Your father fell in love with her and took her from the village. All of the Atori tribe have a strange power, but Shira's was especially strong. She made a barrier to hide the town, but your father came through it easily. Come to think of it, he was unusual too. Were you summoned by your father? Yes. That fulfills Lola's prophecy. Do you plan to go? No. A disobedient son, unlike your father. <laughs> yes. Good, I will entrust you with the Incan... Incan? Statue handed down to the village. The statues are the key to the Incan riddle. Untouched by human hands for hundreds of years. One statue is a shred of the king. Alright. Later, dude. Oh, so then after I go through this cave, I can run down the hill and leap through the air like I just did. No, I... Okay, didn't actually mean to play the melody. Oh, I'm supposed to run at the wall. I think. Maybe not. Oh. Making a noise. How do I psycho dash? I don't understand. I don't understand. What am I doing? How about a key? Nope. Definitely not that one. Is this a Psycho Dash? Uh, what? How do I Psycho Dash? Like, dash like a Psycho? You're not equipped. Uh, I don't understand. How do I psycho dash? I thought I was just doing it when I ran. Use all my skill. I can't even get in the door, dude. That is cool, though. Oh, a little run back spot? That's kind of neat. Alright, um, can you teach me how to Psycho Dash? The Incas who lived here were a tribe without a written language. Their legends are left in song. Even in seemingly meaningless melodies, there's a message. Alright. Nah. 
Yeah, make friends with Lola. I'm not ready for you. Why can't you leave them alone? I mean, I... I don't know. Many who set foot in the Incan ruins have never returned. Okay, so there's Incan ruins below the fairy village. Hey, what's with the ladder? I want to I wanna go that way. This is a very strange game, folks. Can't go behind the house. Is there anything down here? No, just Lily's house. I guess I could talk to the girls. It's a great village. The breeze is refreshing. Thank you so much, princess. What? Inca statue? It's said that it's in a cave on the outskirts of town. Seems there's a wall that sounds different when struck. No, I noticed that. I just don't know what to do with it. Hey, grandparents. How is the elder? When you fought the demon at Edward Castle, did you find a shiny silver stone? Wait, did I fight a demon? child with a good heart who controls the dark power will set out to save the world. At that time, a huge comet will enter Earth's orbit and a dark power will arise. Um, am I the dark power? What a twist, you're the villain. Alright, Gaia, how do I Psycho Dash? Go. No, I actually wanted the beginning of that. Oh, okay. It doesn't actually say how to do it. It just says I can. And that's just a normal run. Oh, I didn't actually mean to run out, but alright. Later, Gaia. Yeah, I'll be surprised. Move. Elder. No, no, you're boring. You're all boring. How do I psycho dash? I mean, I can run like a psycho. I'm not equipped. I can spin my flute at the wall. I don't know how to psycho dash. It doesn't really explain. It just says you can. All right, folks. I, I'm not going to waste a bunch of time hitting this wall. I'm just going to look up how to psycho dash because I don't want to waste the time looking at this wall and hitting it. Okay, that was dumb. I probably should have figured that out, but let's try it. Yeah, okay. You just hold the attack button. Oh, that was it. Alright. You found Incan Statue A. I love the idea that they have written on the bottom side, or like they have a little tag, like courtroom evidence. It's like Exhibit A, Incan Statue. Alright, so I kind of want to see what this... Um, actually, let's just test this out quick. What does it do... When I'm not close up against the wall. Oh, okay. It moves me like four feet forward and backwards. All right. Oh. Oh, no. Come on. All right. Yeah, that was dumb. I just didn't want to stand there and just keep hitting the wall. All right. I got... The Incan statue. Did I go in here? Yeah. She's like, Incan people are special. Be nice. But whatever she said, I don't know. Great village, yep, yep, yep. Moon tribe? Not a tribe, more like a strange shadow form. A high mountain peak near here has become their home. Yeah, let's go. I'm going to. I want to see the Moon Tribe. Since I escaped the confinement of the castle, I want to see and hear everything. Too dangerous for a princess. If you don't want to bother Will, just wait here quietly. I seem to be the only one left out. So I'll talk to Grandma Lola. Nya, nya. 
She's sulking. It's good medicine for a selfish girl. Alright. Oh, so she's actually not coming with us. Karen is staying behind. Home of the Moon Tribe. Alright. Oh, no, skip more dialogue because I tried to move. Good evening, out for a stroll? Who is it? Up, up, this body is lighter than air. What are you? Old man, ghost. Shadows. Oh, they're horrific. The comet is a vehicle of destruction whose evil light has changed all creatures. It's a remnant of a weapon from a terrible battle long ago. The world will be unbearable? Yes, you're bright, but you're still immature. Wow, thanks, creepy head. One of my party has been kidnapped. Know your destination? No. Maybe someone's chasing you? Wherever there's light, there are shadows. We, who were changed by being bathed in the light only once, will spend our future in a world without light. This game is really dark. This is the fourth time. The more light that reaches you, the stronger the dark power. What will be born of the light this time? We saw the destruction of the Incan Empire. The Incan statue sleeps in the cave below. If you like, we'll give it to you. At any rate, go look in the cave. Coo coo coo. They've gone kind of loony. This is the final shape of those touched by the comet's light. They are horrible creatures whose hearts are filled with hatred and disgust. Destroy them within 20 seconds. I'll give you the Incan statue. Coo coo coo. What? Oh. So they become bugs. What I'm what I'm hearing here. Hey, good boy. Coo coo coo, I'll give you the ink statue. I mean it was right here, I probably could have just taken it and you wouldn't have been able to stop me, you flying disincorporated head. You've got ink and statue B. Yay! The story of this is so bizarre. I'm expecting dialogue so I'm not moving. But apparently there is none. So let's just get out. Oh, that statue. You are great. Go to the Incan ruins? Sure! I don't want to fight the demons, but if my father's alive, I'll risk anything to see him. You don't really understand until you lose your parents. Typical. I understand. Let's go to the ruins. They headed to the ruins. All right. Mode 7 graphics. Coming in to make us sick. Did someone mention the Moon Tribe? Because it was like, I got that statue, and then Will's like, I heard of this tribe that no one told me about, but we should definitely go visit them. I don't know. This is kind of a weird game, guys. Entrance to Ruins. Here's the entrance to the ruins. They say that this is where the puzzle of the Incan legend is hidden. I heard this story from the Elder when I was a child. After being invaded, the Incas decided to leave their native land to find a new world. They secretly built a huge ship and filled it with priceless gold artifacts, but there's no record of the ship leaving. It's probably the Incan gold ship in the story. I don't think the Elder has ever told that story to any outsider. I wonder what he wants you to do. Is Gaia an Incan? Oh. You're so mean, leaving me behind. How could you do that? Sorry, Karen. Why are you in a place like this? It's dangerous. Lola told me about this place I've been waiting. I thought you'd left me. You should tell me where you're going. What is Will looking for in the ruins? I can't just wait around and eat while Will is working so hard. I've been waiting here for Will to return. The princess wouldn't understand. I'll wait for you here, okay? Oh. Bye, girls. Put the statue of the Lurai Cliff... On the Lurai cliff below the ruins where the spirit's breath cannot reach. The valley wind will lead you to the gold ship. Okay. Wait. 
There is a tremendous wind at the Lorag Cliff. Um, this is a cliff with no wind. My heart beats fast. Actually, I wanted to... They said to check out suspicious things, and this is suspicious right here. See that little hole? I don't seem to be able to do anything with it, though. Alright. I tried to psycho dash at it, but I can't. Alright, cliff with no wind. And now I can attack again. Big head. Alright, whatever. Oh, alright, now we've got a Legend of Zelda ish section here. Ooh, bounce like ping pong balls. Oh, okay. Ah, I thought it was just cardinal directions. Not bad. Uh, nope. Alright, enemies defeated. Watch out for these things. Walked right into it. Excellent. These are by far the most dangerous thing in this place. I mean, I guess the spikes are probably pretty dangerous if I were to land on them. Yay! What did I get? My defense has increased. So what's my defense now? What's over here? Nothing! Okay. Linear path, that's fine. Oh, hey, it's uh, one of you bugs that the floating heads told me about. Yep. Cool. So you were people, but then you had too much light and you turned into bugs? Sound right to anybody? I like the music. Music's pretty cool. I gotta stop getting hit by these things. So are these like lava monsters, or what am I looking at here? I hope my flute attacks get stronger eventually, because five hits on these things kind of sucks. Your HP power has increased. Oh, now I get stairs. Oh, it's just a loop. Okay, it's a shortcut. Oh, wait. That's a ramp. Let's, um, let's play on the ramp. Okay, let's get a good running start. Yay! Okay, well, we just ran up the stairs and we did exactly what I expected. You found the diamond shaped block! What? Alright. Great. Thrilled to make this discovery. Let's go left. I thought there was a passage right here. Maybe there wasn't. I thought there was another route. Was there a route I didn't take? Oh, right here. Diamond shaped block. Neat. Alright. Oops. Item. Diamond shaped block. Okay. Oh, okay. I was like, wondering what was going on. Alright. Cool. I like the gameplay a lot in this. There are a lot of ideas I really like about it. I'm definitely not hating this game. I don't feel like I'm being unjustly punished for playing it like I did when I was playing Landstalker. So, I mean, it's definitely a very different and, in that case, good experience. 
Oh, I wasn't expecting that. Oh, I'm back at the entrance. Okay, just a shortcut. So I could go out and talk to the girls if I wanted to, but why? They contribute nothing but anxiety. Great. Guess we're going in this one. Okay. Yeah, I, I am enjoying the gameplay a lot. I think the story and the writing is a little weird. The psycho dashing. Yeah, that's what I thought. I wish it didn't take so long to charge. That's kind of annoying. But I guess I can do it as I walk, right? Yeah, that worked fine. I found an herb! Oh, right there. I see Gaia hanging out. That's probably where we're going to stop and save once we get there. Let's get our Psycho Dash ready. Now, if we hit a bug with a Psycho Dash attack... Oh, wait. Hmm. Alright. I was not expecting to get stymied like that. I, uh... What do I do now? How do I get over there? Let me through. I have no psychic powers that help here. These, these impenetrable blocks that seem to come up to my ankles. Alright, so I got... What did I even get from that box? Oh, I got an herb. Oh, rearrange items. Okay, let's put the herb in... There we go. Hey, perfect. It's handy. Shaped like a spirit. Okay. I'm not sure what I'm doing now, but I seem to be quite stuck. Am I supposed to do something with one of the statues? Is the Incan secret hidden in the statue? Sure again. Let's check in with the girls. Maybe they know something. Remember with the uh, statue on the below the ruins where the spirit's breath cannot reach. Yeah. No, I didn't find what I was looking for. Actually, I'm stuck. I followed the ladders. Oh! Nope, that's the same ladder. Never mind. I thought I found something cool by exploring, but it's not cool at all. Maybe here? Hey, okay. Nope. Um. Oh, I don't want to discard the item. I just wanted to unequip it because I don't want to accidentally play flute music. Oh, you guys are just next to each other, huh? There we go. I just didn't want to get hit again. Will this actually hurt them? Oh, it does. Okay. I like that these little gem thingies don't disappear. At least they haven't yet. Okay, more bugs. Easy bug. Oh, I got hit. Nice. Trash talking the bug, and that's what happens. Alright. Well, I really wanted to save at that guy up checkpoint. Oh! Your strength has increased. Okay, I thought I actually got a floating sword, like a weapon familiar or something. That would be cool. What? Are you? Oh, 
Okay, I can just kill you like any other enemy. Alright. No big deal. What are you? Oh, this, this looks like a problem. Actually, it doesn't seem to be able to hit me at all. the slime. I like the the detail of having the actual like floor below display. I think that's cool. That seems like it's gonna come to life when I get up these stairs. Is it gonna come to life or no? I don't know. Eh. I'm glad I looked up how to Psycho Dash. It's actually like a critical skill. No point of that hallway. I cannot carry it between screens, though. Oh, I just stood there like an idiot. It twice. Alright. I can go that way and up the ladder. Which I guess is where I'm supposed to go. For another shortcut. I'm not gonna bother right now. Oh, that actually looks like an Incan soldiery guy. Oh, okay. He just shoots fire like you, like uh, like Incans did, you know. It's totally how Incan culture worked. They come to life like the. Um, those bouncing heads in Link to the Past. Alright. Uh, my timing on that is bad. They are pretty non-threatening though, honestly. Stepping on a gold tile emits a sound. There are four gold tiles. Stand on each of the four tiles at the same time. Wait, how am I supposed to step on all of them at the same time? Oh, am I supposed to, like, hunt you? Oh. Alright. Four guys. I'm supposed to probably get them in some kind of a line. Yeah, I think I broke it. Unless I could put a head down here. Can I drop a head here? Doesn't seem like it. Just step on all four at the same time. Let's try a psycho dash. Yay! Okay. Let's reset this room. Or maybe I can go get my friends and they can each stand on one. Nope, I'm gonna reset the room. Yep, yep, yep. Come on, guys. Wake up. Wake up. Alright. Can y'all step on a tile, please? Help me out here. I think I'm doing this wrong. Can you, can you guys line up? Like, cooperate with each other. Probably why your entire culture died. Ugh, this sucks. Come on, guys. Work with me here. I don't even care. I just want you guys to work with me a little bit. Now I'm getting wrecked because I'm messing around with these weird Incans. Alright, I just took a bunch of damage for no reason. Um, I don't know what to do in that room. Maybe I'm missing a statue? Maybe? is back towards the beginning. Yeah, alright. That's not it. Wait, I definitely have not been on top of an Incan head. 
Let's go check this out. Oh, I thought I could jump off. Man. How do I get up? How do I want to get on the head. There should be like a path right here that leads me down to the head. Alright. Eh, maybe I'm overthinking this. Maybe I'm overthinking. Hmm. That's not a bad pun. Thinking. It's a terrible pun. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> I, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm running around like an idiot. What's over here? Oh, that's where I just came from. Alright. Let's go talk to the girls again? I guess? I don't know. They really don't contribute much to this conversation. I really would love to save. I wanted to save ten minutes ago. Alright. Girls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're just suck. Okay. Can't go that way. What am I doing? How do I get where I want to go? Can I jump? Thanks. Saves me a little time. Alright. Can't jump any lower from here. This is the one that's blocked off. Okay. So this is useless. Can't do anything here. What was this one? Okay, this is where I destroyed those spinny things. I went down here, followed the path, and then went this way, which dropped me off here. Oh, do I have to run? Is that it? Let's try with that. This is just a one-way staircase for no reason. I can't get to this head either, which is actually kind of bothering me a little bit. I feel like if I could destroy this head, it would uh, open up a pathway or something. But maybe I'm just sorely mistaken. Okay, so I had to go this way. Brought me back to the cliff. There was nothing here. Can't jump down more. Some enemies that I have not defeated because I can't figure out how to get to them. And then we're back at the ink and it idiots. Stand on each of the four tiles at the same time. How? Four enemies. Yeah, no, I'm aware. Thank you, map. Can I get just you to come with me? Yeah, it's not... It's not making any kind of sound or... anything that indicates that it's working. Uh, I don't get this part. I thought maybe I missed a path down here, but there's nothing. Just these four guys in a room with these four tiles that I can't possibly hit all at the same time. I'm like two-thirds dead. Yeah, four gold tiles, same time. I don't get this. Um, I really don't understand. I think I did everything there. I'm, I'm very much stuck at this... Hmm. I have an idea. Okay. I have to use... Yep, 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 yep. 
I have to use my psychic power to drag these guys. Okay. Not quite Legend of Zelda, but close, sort of. Right. You come up here too. So I don't want you to come to life. I just want to drag you guys. You're a little too close, I think. Let's pull you up. Back you up. Bring you back. Maybe this is good enough. I don't know. Okay. No, that's too far now. I'm trying really hard not to wake these guys up. I think this is what I need to do. I forgot I have this psychic flute thing that sort of works. Sort of doesn't. Sometimes it's what you gotta use. Hey, okay. Alright, that's good. Because I was running out of ideas here. These say Oh! Is that good? I don't think that's good. I think that's bad, actually. That was good. That was bad. That was also bad. I, that's one thing I do not miss about games of this era, is like their inability to be consistent with elevation and height and stuff like that. There's no way that thing should have been able to hit me. Um, I'm going to save in just a second, but I kind of want to clear out this space, actually. How many enemies? Two more? Well, let's get rid of the enemies, then we'll go save. This game actually has a really, because of its style, it actually works really well with, oh, I just shot right in the face. Um, it works really well with um, no enemy respawns because like that's literally the point is that the enemies do not respawn. All right, Gaia, how you doing? Give me health, please. Yep, close your eyes. Record. No. Friends, thank you so much for watching this episode of Illusion of Gaia. I hope you enjoyed it. Got stuck a little bit, but not too, too bad. It's a really weird story. I like the gameplay a lot. Still kind of trying to get a sense for what I'm doing in this, though. But we'll be back next week with part three. In the meantime, if you enjoyed this video, you know what to do. If you haven't checked out my other stuff, how dare you? Go fix that right now. There's lots and lots and lots of options. Ranging from retro RPGs to Deus Ex to zombie survival with Seven Days to Die and Dead Island. So anyway, check out some of my stuff. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Be kind to yourselves. Be kind to each other. And, of course... We'll be back with a brand new episode of Illusion of Guy in one week. We'll be back with a brand new content tomorrow. Because there's new content every single day on this channel. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one.